Hello everybody and thanks for tuning back in. Today my children wanted to make some pendants and we wanted something other than clear. So we decided to try this sidewalk chalk and see how that would work in coloring our resin. So we picked a pink and blue chalk. Broke off a small piece and crushed it. In the video, I didn't crush it into a fine powder because it's not really what I wanted. I wanted somewhat of a mottled appearance, and you'll see at the end of the video it turned out really well. If you want an even color, then of course you want to crush it to it's a fine powder and then mix it really well, probably in some warm epoxy. As I said in a previous video, you can use a hair dryer on a low setting to help remove any bubbles that may have formed. And once you're finished, let it sit overnight. And here we go. Let's see how these turned out. There we go. You can see the mottled color in it from this side. I really like the way it looks. And here 
Here's one where Abby mixed the colors. Man, that looks fantastic to me. It's sort of like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Now these are some crafts that kids would love to make. Next step, get your hardware. I took the long pieces and clipped them short enough to work with. Here I just use a set of fingernail clippers. Then I grab my Dremel tool with a fine bit and drill maybe 3 sixteenths of an inch deep. Then you just get some good old fashioned crazy glue, apply it over the holes, insert your hardware, and it's pretty much good to go. I'll also apply a second drop later just to make sure it's holding well. And here's a sample of the finished products. I like the way they look. I thought they came out really great. And I think this mottled appearance looks a lot better than just a solid color. But that's totally up to you. It's whatever you like. Well, that's all for today. Thanks everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe. As always, be blessed.